it's been a long time coming so uh if you're here welcome to my channel <laughs> i can't believe i'm finally saying that like y'all have been wanting to do youtube for so long and really ain't nothing been stopping me but me so if you're seeing this and you got something that you want to do bitch go do it because ain't nothing stopping you but you period anyways child i guess i'm just gonna tell y'all a little bit about me and about what my channel is gonna be about it's gonna be all about me it's like it's like my own little reality show like for real like we're gonna get into the nitty fucking gritty bitch period so um as y'all can see by the name on the channel, my name is Mia Benet. I live in ATL, the Dirty South. And what else? What else? I'm 23. I'm a Pisces. Curious. We're the superior sign. No ifs, ands, or buts. And um, I have my college degree. It's in my storage unit somewhere. It's not what I wanted to do, but I didn't have anything else to do. So I went to college for four years and I got my degree in criminal justice. You see, I barely knew what it was. <laughs> I couldn't even remember what the degree was in, child. But yeah, I got my degree in um, criminal justice. And currently I have a job. I'm not going to tell you all where I work or what I do until I quit. Because I plan on quitting in like, I'll hit a year in August. And this will be like my first job that... I will have ever worked for a year like everywhere else less than a year because you know I love to quit me a job but I plan on quitting and I'm praying praying actually I okay I am praying on a low but I'm gonna say it like this by August I will be a full-time content creator full-time youtuber tiktoker whatever whoop. I'm going to be my own like I'm gonna be self-employed period so yeah by august i want to quit my job and i want to be able to make a full-time income on here i don't know why it took me so long to start but i'm here now okay hello that's i have some other goals that i want to complete this year um one of my major goals that i'm doing right now is going one place a month and that's another thing my channel will be about travel i know i'm kind of like all over the place just just stay with me we're getting somewhere my channel be about travel not just about travel like i want to do like get ready with me is a day in my life vlogs maybe especially travel vlogs because i go one place a month at least one place a month sometimes i go more like in um january i went to mexico february i went to florida phoenix and la march which i'm a march pisces <laughs> Uh, for my birthday, I took a solo trip to Peru. Had the time of my life. Best trip ever. Um, April, where did I go? Oh, I went to New Orleans last month. Um, and this month, I went to I went to Minneapolis. But I also was supposed to be going to Tokyo. And I might give y'all a little story time on that. Not in this video, but in another video. Because I took footage and everything. So I just got to tell y'all what happened, child. I love to model. That's that is my biggest goal that I actually want to accomplish in life. Like that's one of my careers that I actually want to be doing. I want to model. I will be a model. I'm five ten. Lately, I've been learning Spanish, so me llamo Mia Bene. I love to sew. I've been sewing since I was about thirteen. I learned how to sew from my family and consumer sciences. Team. Wait, was it? Yeah, I think it was Family and Consumer Sciences. Um, my sister, she taught me how to sew because my Nana, she bought my older sister a sewing machine and I guess she didn't want to use it. So I learned how to use it and I've been doing that as like a little hobby ever since. I've made money here and there off of it. Um, I'll actually be making a video soon because one of my friends want, wants me to make her um, birthday dress. She's turning the big 21. Don't play with her. And yeah, I guess I'll do something on this channel too. My channel is really about to be like some all around shit, like DIY, travel, vlogs. It's about to be fun. And I can't wait for y'all to join a ride with me. But yeah, so I have two sisters. I have an older sister, I have a younger sister. 
And of course, I'm the middle child because, I mean, look at me. I exude middle child. <laughs> okay, so I found my questions. Um, it's only a few of them, but, you know, it's, it's just the first video. Like, come on. Like I said in the beginning, bear with me. I'm new to this, not true to this. I'm finna be true to this, though, because we, we speak positive around these parts. Okay? Um, so somebody asked me what made me start YouTube well i got a lot to say and it's like my podcast but i don't want to do no podcast people <laughs> the podcast i be seeing they need to be off there okay so this is like my own little personal bubble because i already talk i already talk um what's the word i already talk out loud you know in public like this is just in a private for at least see nobody's in here with me but um I just feel like I have, I, I don't know. I have the personality for it and I say a lot of shit and some of the shit that actually should not be said out loud. And I felt like I just want to, I just want to build my life. And I feel like YouTube will get me to where the places I want to be in life, like modeling, networking with more people because I just moved back to the A. I used to live in Savannah um, for a little while because I went to school down there and then I started working down there. And then, you know, a lot of other stuff happened down there, but it just was not for me. I feel like Savannah is the place that you go when you want to retire. Excuse me. And I'm only 23. I'm not retiring anytime soon, unfortunately. I, bitch, I don't want to work right now. <laughs> um. So, and I want to work for myself. Like, I'm so, like, I just feel like I have the type of soul that I'm not supposed to be punching in the clock and not not saying anything's wrong with that. I've done that for the past, I don't know, since I was 16. No, no, no. I got my first job when I was 17, I think. Yeah, when I was 17. So I've been doing that shit since I was 17. Bitch, I'm tired. I want to work for myself. I want to be able to wake up when I want to. Like when I was working at Savannah, I was waking up at three o'clock in the morning to go to work and be there by four o'clock in the morning. Do you know how tiring that is? I mean, yeah, I would get off at like noon, but by the time I get off, I don't want to do shit but sleep. That's draining. And then right now my schedule is 2.15 p.m. to 10.45 p.m. That's my whole fucking day gone, y'all. Please blow me up. I'm tired of working. Please. Anyways, next question. <laughs> my favorite hobbies. Um, I said this already, but you know, sewing. I love to swim, y'all. I love to swim. I don't do it often because I wear a lot of wigs. And Lord knows I love me a good wig, child. But I love swimming. I love sewing. I love shopping. I love traveling. And I like trying new things. I love trying different foods from, like, different cultures. Um, like, when I went to Peru, oh, my God, y'all. The food. The food was so fucking good so fucking good like i daydream about it i literally have to find me peruvian spots just to get that taste again and maybe authentic places so let me know if y'all y'all want the hookup i got you i got the plug bitch for real um what keeps me going in life my phone is like blowing up let me put this on dnd um but what keeps me going in life i want to say my family like me and my mom we did not used to be cool at all like it was times like i wouldn't call her for months that's how uncool we were but lately like that's my bitch like we're besties for lifers for real like i can talk to her about almost anything her and my dad like those two are like my lifeline truly and I'm not really this vulnerable or like I wouldn't I don't think I would say these things out loud in person because it's just like like <laughs> I can't explain it it's like it doesn't make me feel icky but it's just like oh that's so like that's corny <laughs> like, but it's cute at the same time but it's just like I don't know I just don't feel comfortable saying corny shit like that <laughs> out loud <laughs> unless I'm in a room by myself like I am right now so but yeah, those two right there, like those are my lifelines and like my sisters. I love 
excuse me i love them um well my heart my friends my friends definitely keep me going like all my friends were like family for real like i i love those people to the death of me um and then just me knowing that i want better for myself knowing that what i do right now is not the life i want to live and there's a plan for me god's plan of course and you know everything that the universe has in store for me i have to go get it so this is me going to get it i'm here so like and subscribe don't forget to do that um but yeah let me see if i can find some more questions because i'm not really sure how long this video is supposed to fucking be since it's really just like getting to know me let's see let's see let's see um who is my best friend i saw my best friend her name is kelly um sometimes i call her jelly sometimes i call her stupid bitch it's no in between like that's my girl you're it um speaking of her we are going to the beyonce concert in july and guess what seats we got club renaissance bitch also i curse a lot like it's just it's just a thing with me like i just i just do there's there's no reason I just do it because I couldn't do it when I was younger. Now I'm older. I'm going to do it in every fucking sentence I fucking can. Thank you. Um, but yeah, that also leads me to my favorite artist, which is Beyonce. I love me some Beyonce. I love me some Megan. Even Lotto. Like, she's starting to get up there on my list. Like, that's a bad bitch. Like, every time I look on her Instagram, she always doing like this little post. Like, and I just feel like I cannot. I <laughs> I cannot fucking do it, but I like me. And I can't, I don't know. It's just, I try, but I just feel like I don't look as seduc seductive as her. Um, So yeah, those are my three favorite artists right now. Um, da -da -da. Tattoos. Yes, I have four tattoos. Yeah, I got four tattoos. Sorry, I can't count. Um, I got one on my leg. It's a snake. I got this one on the back of my arm. It's a tiger. I got this one. And then I have a Playboy bunny on my right booty cheek. So, yeah. Um, my favorite perfume, bitch. You did not hear this from me. And if y'all sell it out, we gonna have a motherfucking problem. This. Jimmy Choo. I want you. It comes in a red box. I don't know what the black box smells like, but the one I buy is in a red box. It's fucking amazing. Like, that shit. Oh my God, y'all. If I could marry a perfume, it would be that perfume. That's how good it smells. Like, I just, I love that down. How would my best friends describe me? Probably a dumb bitch but a smart bitch at the same time with a smart ass mouth um tall you know that sound on tiktok that'd be like i have got a girl whose pussy is so good if you threw it up in the air it would turn into sunshine i feel like that's how actually i feel like that's how they might describe me like yeah if i if i had to pick one quote it would be that. Um, but I'm also, <laughs> they probably might say that's conceited of me. But I just feel like I'm not conceited. I'm just, I'm confident to an extent. Like, I know what I'm worth and I'm adding tax. So, yeah. What you see is what you get. And then whatever comes out of my mouth is what you also get. Because I don't know why, this, why I even say some of the things that I do. But. I do and it just gets said. I don't I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, so that's me. I hope you like what I have to offer and um you'll subscribe and like this video because we're gonna have a lot of fun on this channel. Like I even know how to build shit. Like I built I built this vanity that I'm sitting at right now and I actually have a video coming out on it but i'll show y'all give y'all a little sneak peek a little tour this is it it looks kind of like a mess right now and that's me but yeah this is the vanity this is how my light and stuff is set up and this is 
some shea butter that I get from uh, one of my homegirl moms. She makes the best. So yeah, like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.